friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Steffi here. So I thought I would show you guys what I use to store all of my planner kits. So I have eight binders here from Target. These are always out of sale, out of stock. It's a one inch binder by Green Room. So just check out Target.com or go to your store, but I never have any luck. I got these around Black Friday. It's been a while. So the first binder I'm going to show you, it just has, it's a three ring mini one inch binder it has a pocket on the side which you cannot keep much in so i just keep some add-ons that i bought that i need to get the full kits to so i just keep them on the side as a reminder of the kits that i need to buy sometimes i just um wait for a sale to go on or don't have the money at the time so i just get the um add-ons because sometimes it's hard to get the add-ons after the sale but as you can see it's a tight fit so in this planner, this binder, I keep like my planner girl kit. So it's really easy to open up the binder and it's just a, pla um, what do you call it? A sheet protector and it has more than the three holes as you can see. And it's a decent size and it's easy to slip the kits in there. I just um, keep the plastic that the kits came in just in case one day if I want to sell the kits I have the plastic and it keeps everything together so everything is not spilling out and those mini binder sheet protectors the size are five and a half inches by eight and a half inches or 13.9 centimeters by 21.5 centimeters when you go on target.com I noticed that the mini binder sheet protectors came up as an add-on option but I got mine from Amazon which um, are sold out so just do some research I gave you guys some measurements and just just look around so I tried to organize everything as best as I could by categories so this is like a planner girl related um, category so all the kits that are like that I keep and if anything extra comes with the kit I also keep it together and I just throw them all in here. I try to have everything coordinated, but sometimes y'all just don't happen that way. And I keep the extra sheets, blank sheets in the back. So if I want to add more, I can. But this is it. I'm not buying any more binders. If nothing don't fit, then I don't need to buy it because this is getting ridiculous. So in this binder, I keep everything that's like fall related. Anything... Um, just warm, pretty, fall tones, any kind of kits are like that I keep in this binder. And fall is my absolute favorite. I just love the feel and the color of fall and apple picking and sweaters and uh, anything like that. So I keep that in here. Oh, and this Bloom's kit is my absolute favorite. And I don't divide the kits by shops either, so... I have QT Planner Co. I have Glam Planner. I have Sweet Tea Plans. So I keep everything in that one binder. And I don't understand why they have a barcode in the middle and then a barcode on the back, which is so ugly. I need to fill that up. And this was not my favorite design, but it was the only design they had. And I'm like, you know what? I need to get these kits together. They're all over the place. This section I keep just like anything girly chilling relaxing I keep everything in here so this way this really helps me out because I was just buying multiple kits not realizing that I had them already anybody get time for that so perfect example for this kit it had came with some page flags so I just keep everything together which makes sense instead of keeping the page flag somewhere separate. I just keep everything together so that way I have all the parts of my kit together and I like everything nice and neat. So that is basically it for this section. I love that kit by Scribble Prince Co. and that glitch one and I might move some things around because some sections I noticed I just threw together. I just wanted to get everything out of the containers that I had it in and you can see that this is the really nice and thick and yet it still holds it this one is my holiday 
steam and any like little leftovers that weren't in a kit I just put over to the side so that way when I open it I can pull to match different kits so everything is just holiday um 4th of July oh holiday and winter so Christmas um winter um these are from movies this is from a Christmas story and the other one is from Home Alone so cute two of my all-time favorite holiday movies and anything like this one's Halloween and that one's Little Red Riding Hood but it gave me a winter vibe and I have some Thanksgiving kits and um oh also these sheet protectors hold various sizes like I have an essentials kit from Glam Planner and then I also have a bitty kit so as you can see large small medium sized kits it will hold it all and I'll pull out another one so you guys can see a different size this is this one right here is like a regular size kit that most kids come in so as you can see it will hold different sizes which is perfect and I don't divide them between mini kits essentials anybody got time for that and this binder really needs to be reorganized a little bit more better I could probably have all the Halloween stuff closer together, all the Thanksgiving things closer together. But as of right now, I just wanted to get everything in a binder and then I can go back and rearrange everything later. And this video was a long time coming, so I wanted to just hurry up and put this out because this is mad late. And then I also have some stickers that are like Black Friday theme shopping, so I have those in there also. And then some more Halloween kits. And then as you can see, I have sticky notes and extras that went with that kit. I love how everything is just together in one place instead of me going all over the place looking for things in these different containers that I had. This just wasn't working anymore. So this next kit I divided into food and like movies, which I hope that makes sense. So I have some like Cinco de Mayo and then I have some like picnic kits and this one she's in Paris with the macarons and this is like a stay in bed she has her tray of food and this one's like a coffee shop and I left um a blank space to fill that in with something else and this one is like now my movie section movie Moana oh and TV um Sailor Moon does anybody remember that cartoon Sailor Moon I used to love that and then I have a cinema go to the movies kit and I also have Cinderella and Mean Girls and I have a Mean Girls Broadway New York City kit and I put Disney in here I mean it's not like it's more like a destination I probably could put that in a destination section but it had food in it and then I have my um, Disney villains and I have my Harry Potter I collect all the houses even though I am a Hufflepuff and then this one I thought that was Cinderella but I'm not sure so I threw that back there anyway and then in this next binder which is pretty thick also this is where I keep my monthly kits so and then on the side in my pocket I had an extra September I just put that on the side and yes yeah, so I've already been using the course in January so here's May through June and I think I'm missing April and July and then the rest of this is like my summer kit so anything bright beachy picnic um I threw in here I could organize a little bit better um carnival mermaid camping like that was a 90 summer unicorns April like spring flowers whatever I threw it in here sailing so everything is nice and neat and organized and that's one is a safari and then the last one is which one is this one this one is real thick that one's thick too I guess this is like I threw everything here it's supposed to be like a travel kind of setup Oh, that train kit is gorgeous. Let me go and find her. So, like travel, and then I have some like kind of space kits. As you can see, this has no real organization. 
so I'm gonna go through and reorganize this one and then I have like some floral kits behind that and one I think I have like one baby shower kit I had nowhere to put that and then like some wedding kits and some more floral kits so as you can see it's just like this one is kind of organized but not really but so that is it you guys thank you so much and I'll try to put the measurements of everything down at the bottom no links Bye.